okay guys I found the error let me show you what that was first let me just remove these folders here you can see by mistake we have copied this this tag which you can see here you can see but we want this tag here you can see this come under this that's why we want this div tag and this class okay that's why we were not getting anything there let's change it to div and let's change the class and uh, if I print it yep we are getting and uh, if I print this we will get the price the address and the description now guys we have captured this data now it's time to put this in a CSV file for that first we need to create a dictionary let D let's create an empty dictionary first and now let me remove this print from here from here and from here if you have watched the full course of Python to AI ML and data science you will know that to store the values in this dictionary you need to specify the attribute like price equals to this value then D a address equals to this value and at last D square brackets D E S C R I B T I U and description equals to not description it's description equals to this value okay okay we got some syntax error okay guys one more thing is that we have to append this we have to store this in a this um, I mean we have to store this dictionary into a list for that let's create an empty list and let's store it in a list now l dot a p p e n d and d still the syntax error okay here you can see I have put the double square now yep it's perfectly working now now we have to put this list into a CSV file for that I need to import the pandas library pandas and now let's create a data frame df equals to pandas dot data frame l and we want to store this value in this data frame that's why I'm putting here L and now you have to type a very very big line of code which is df2 csv sorry csv now the biggest part is that you have to name the file <laughs> data dot data dot csv yep it's working fine and now if you check the folder here you can see the datas.csv file has been created now if i open it here you can see i got the data and it's perfectly fine so that's all for this tutorial and if you have any kind of doubt you can ask me in the comment box so thank you and meet you in the next tutorial